In this episode, we will have someone win Veto, someone be eliminated, and someone win HOH. Along with someone winning Uno, which I feel like will be Pratt. The house guests are discussing what they should do. Some trying to take their mind off it because they know they're safe. Go ahead and play that intro. Your mom and dad are doing fine. You guys are on my mind. You asked me what I wanted to be, and now I think the answer is plain to see. I want to be famous. Are you good, bro? Yeah, calm down. Zach not stressing, he just be pressing. All right, Hero and Connor are really, really hoping that one of them wins this veto or someone from their alliance. Yo, Cedar, what, what, what you mad at? All right, so this little group is discussing who they should vote. All right, and I'm pretty sure they are all on the same page. Even if the veto is spun and not even in their favor. What are you guys talking? Oh, she is high. All right, well, let me go get the others. Because it is time for veto and now for someone else to be evicted. All right, thank you everyone for joining me at the ceremony. Here in just a moment, you guys will vote someone out of the house. But for now, let's do Vito. And the winner of Vito, congratulations, Lanelle. Yeah, you may choose someone of your choice to be put off the block. Oh, this makes them quite happy. All right, Lanelle. You have a choice. You can either save someone from the block or do nothing. And she has decided to use the power of veto on Hero. Congratulations, you are no longer up for elimination. Please take a seat as Solo tries to find out and discuss who will be the replacement nominee. Linnell, you have made your choice and you are immune. Oh wait, she is pitching an idea to him real quick. Ooh, they plan a little. All right, Solo, after discussing with some of your teammates, who have you decided to be the second house guest nominated? He has decided that the second nominee will be... I'm so sorry, but it is you, Zach, the second person nominated for eviction. One of you are about to leave the household. Everyone will now, one at a time, go vote for someone they wish to evict. Look at this dude. All right, house guests, the votes are in. And it's by a vote of six to six, which means solo, you have a decision to make. Since it is a tie, it is your duty as HOH to be the sole vote that counts as the tiebreaker. You may have a moment to discuss with your teammates if you like. Tina is begging for Zack's survival right in front of everyone. Oh, this makes Hero angry because she's like basically going to war against his boyfriend. You got a decision to make Solo. Solo has casted his vote by a vote of six, six to one. The third person evicted from Total Drama House Havoc is Connor. Please collect your things, say a small goodbye, and leave the household. I'm sorry. Like I said, you may say goodbye however you wish. I'm sorry to see you go once again. Nah, hero, you can't sacrifice yourself. That's not how this game works. Ooh, for the first time, I think I've seen Hero actually insult someone. He called you a Lincoln Loud look-alike bitch. He said you look like Mortal Kombat smoke noob sidebock pubic hair. <laughs> All right, well, unfortunately, Connor, you have to pack your bag, leave the house. 
Your friends, the ones who matter the most, just like always, will be here to say goodbye. And there we have it, the third person evicted from the household. Look at the outside world. They got a small little peek. It's always nice when they do that. But the show has to go on tomorrow. After a good night's sleep, they will do the next HOH competition. Once again, some people will get a second chance, unlike some who will have to watch this game from their couch. Alright, and the ceremony is indeed dismissed. Everyone can do their own thing. Hold on, Tanner cooking something at night. Oh, Han, Tina, what are you making with the fresh veggies? I haven't gotten to see you cook at all, really. So I'm excited to see what you make. Ooh, them pancakes look good as hell. Oh, I see. Alright, overcooked IRL. Let's see what she made. And it was, oh, chili. And that chili looks good, especially with like the sour cream on top. Oh, there there's Hero in his bed where Connor usually is. Oh, he is so angry. He said Solo's about to get his. Oh, I wonder who's sleeping in the pink bed. Oh, Solo and Tracy are gonna share the HOH room with each other. Bottom bunk for Cedar while CC gets the top bunk. Hey, these two staying up getting lit. He said, yeah, yeah. TJ is zooted right now. What you doing up? Oh, he just wants to make sure there's no hard feelings between any of them. You know that face he's making is full of deceit. All right, the next day, people are starting to wake up. By the way, I noticed a lot of comments about people liking his sleepwear. He says, thank you. Oh, you just had to stop and get a little funky. Oh, what you scared of? TJ and Trey were both approached by Solo to offer like a temporary deal. And though he doesn't trust Solo at all, he believes that for now Solo would most likely keep his word. Cedar believes that he is actually in a really good spot. He was scared he wouldn't even last three weeks and here he is. Three weeks in and he feels pretty good about his placement. He outlived his previous placement and he's very happy about that. He feels achieved. Pratt really missed her private bathroom that was a lot better with the branded soaps and such she also misses the nintendo switch she wants to see her animal crossing village back and she was about to beat the fourth gym leader in pokemon sword so she's hoping to win this hoa all right they are starting to arrive for the hoh challenge solo as the previous hoh you do not get to compete in this challenge go spend your last enjoying moments in your hoh room so in pairs of four everyone will get into a hot tub out of those four there will be one winner that one winner will face the other winners in a heat endurance test aka the lobster treatment whoever wins and lasts the longest will become the new hoh with the power good luck we'll draw randomly for hot tub contestants on the pink side of the hot tub challenge is zach tracy Linnell and Hero. And on this side is Cece, Tallula, Cedar, and Tina playing for the blue side. They all feeling themselves. Cedar said, not a bad draw, not a bad draw. Which means everyone else is on the green side. And the winners will go to this luxury one. There they are, all competing. Maybe this is exactly what Hero needed. A nice, relaxing, warm sauna. Zack looks very happy with this warm water. Linnell soaking it all up. Tallulah and Cece enjoying the water very much. Oh, hold on. Tina and Cedar might be the first two to make a sudden drop. Tanner, what are you doing, Tanner? No way you're trying to get Riz. He said, damn, it's warm in this bitch. All right, it has went up by 20 degrees and an hour later, no one has left and cracks are slowly unfolding folding uh what are you what is wrong with you yeah there is a lot more steam right now oh tina's really getting the warmth and so is zach dang two of y'all just went down for a dive maybe that cools them i don't know all right if i heard it correctly tanner you have called me over here because you said it is way 
too damn crispy, been quite a while, and gone up lots of temperatures. I kinda don't blame him, it's kinda really crispy in there, y'all don't understand. They about to be served with butter. First person eliminated from this challenge. Tina said, bet, if I'm not first, then that's good with me. God, it probably feels really good to have the cool air hit your skin. Alright, and with that, I think Tallulah's also done. There she is. At least they can talk to each other. That's probably why she got out. Why'd you get out? You got no excuses. Yeah, look down at your nails. Did I hear someone would like to forfeit? Yeah, you saw your other two buddies out there and you decide hell. It feels toasty. Hey, you weren't the first, second, or third one out of the challenge, so don't feel too disappointed. Now you can sit here with the rest of your homies. All right, way too much clothing to handle this any longer, especially since it just went up a very noticeable 12 degrees. Tracy has had her fair share of this challenge. Congratulations, Green. You're going on strong right now. We could see a winner at any moment from the pink side or the blue. Speak of the devil, they said they have made a deal. Cedar is worried for Cece's health. She might be overheating, so he is dropping out. Hey, at least it's for something noble, probably. Yeah, you can get out. She about die in there. Uh, Cedar peed the pool. Congratulations, Cece, being the first winner out of the three tub. All right, after seeing what Cedar and Cece just did, they said let's go ahead and also make a deal because it's fucking crispy. Linnell is willing to drop out so Hero can move on in the competition a top five in the competition Linnell that's not bad at all all right just because we legally can't the temperature won't turn up anymore but please know that it is lowering their chances of having children as we speak and here the losers sit drying in shame oh wait she's not drying are you good do you need like medical Pratt said well I have clothing on these two are friends I'm not even gonna try and since she left TJ has already decided you know what good luck trey i wish you well in the final three comp trey is doing whatever he's doing i guess to wake himself up he's not looking forward to the crispy balls anymore which means the three winners are now competing and none of them look happy except her she doesn't even really mind all right well trey is trying to keep himself i guess happy or whatever oh hero's not feeling this oh trey is now making a deal with hero where if hero gets out and he wins he promises hero not to put him up and hero obviously accepted that deal so it's now cc versus trey battle of the hoh all right after one degree up in temperature because we got approval from the fda don't ask and after trey looking at cc clearly beast through this challenge for 30 minutes he has decided it is just not worth it he let hero down he let himself and tj down but he did not let cc down who i think already expected this outcome congratulations cc you are the new hoh head of household let's go see your brand new hoh room cc welcome to your new hoh room fully customized to your liking you got the setups and your computer to play any games if you have them if you know what i mean hinton your own supply your favorite foods in there like dove chocolate man and oranges and evaporated milk along with your own custom setup bathroom you earned it with skill and endurance let's see what choices you make on to the coming future thank you guys very much for watching this episode of house havoc have any theories or predictions comment them down below if you guys like this please make sure to leave a like thank you guys all for watching it have a good day